Google Picasso web albums and was invented in 2002. It was purchased by Google in 2004. Google Plus came along in 2008. When viewing your photographs um, in Google Plus, you'll see that it forces and stays inside Google Plus. Sometimes you need to look at PicassoWeb.google because it gives you some extra sharing and editing tools like embedding a whole slideshow. So to get there, uh, I did make a text post. This is a video version of it. And you'll see that on the first link with my 21 digit ID, it says PicassoWeb.google. So when I click through to that and I'm logged in as I'm not logged in at all, uh, it's a incognito window, you'll see that the URL which I left in at the top says plus.google.com. Okay, it defaults it to my plus name, but you'll clearly see, I hope, that this is within the gray bar and the header of Google Plus. Okay, so that's not exactly what we want. So sometimes it is, but when you can look at the photographs, um, it doesn't give you extra sharing tools. So to take that window away, and just go back to the purpose of this video which is to show you what the question mark no, no redirect equals one which means it's forcing it to stay at Picasso web uh, you do exactly the same but on the second link it has the no redirect feature so when I click that and it loads we will have the familiar Google Picasso web albums now you'll see that on the right hand side we've got a lot of comments down there, remember I'm not logged in at all. For each photograph near the RSS button on the right you will have embedding tools and sharing whole album tools. So if you look at the URL at the top you'll notice that it says picasso.google.com forward slash whatever your number is so you can substitute your own 21 digit ID in here and it's got the familiar and I'll just highlight it question mark no redirect equals one. So that should be it. I'll just default back to the beginning, which was a post made by me saying a tip. And what you do have is just the final part. I've made a slide there for an example. But we will have that a difference of what it looks like with top left Google Plus photos. There they are. And Picasa, which is the the wheel. I would strongly recommend downloading Picasso 3.9 to do some photo editing and sharing because it is just excellent. If you see anything from my stream which has a collage or any photographs on my post, 99% I'm always using Picasso. So just go back to the beginning again, uh, which it was. The post that you're looking for is that one there. Thanks very much.